Hey guys, it's Abby from TheUnderRocks.com and it's another V today. I'm actually waiting to go to work right now, so this might be quick. Um, oops, uh, there's a glare. Anyway, um, so today we're supposed to uh, vlog to, or we're supposed to vlog to someone something we wanted to say. Let me see it. Vlog to someone something you o you have always wanted to tell them, but there is no need to say who that person is. Okay, well, person, um, I think that for a very long time I've been so in denial that you pretty much shifted my life. And I know that everything is my choice and everything that I do reflects me. And um, I don't know, I think... I didn't notice this until recently, which it's funny because a lot of people noticed it, that oh, part of my eyebrows a lot longer, that I'm still hurt. Not like emotionally hurt, but like mentally hurt. And I think that there's a, that's probably the reason why sometimes I feel like my relationships just won't work out, work out with anyone, and I mean anyone by like friendships and, and you know, romantic types of relationship, it's because I feel that I'm scared to, to trust someone fully the way that I've trusted you. I've trusted you for so long that I was so comfortable in my zone that I didn't know, um, what was any other way of doing things. I was so comfortable with the way things were and when things didn't work out, you know, it wasn't just because they didn't work out. There's a lot of reasons why that I don't have to point out. But, um, you know, it's caused me a lot of, of emotional, mental pain. And um, it was very hard very hard to get through a lot of stuff. It took literally years for me to be somewhat alright with myself and I think at this point I always tell myself that I've, you know, it's an experience and that I'm alright with everything but at the end of the day it's like, who am I kidding because people can still see it that I'm still kind of fixing myself I guess you could say that I'm still struggling to make everything better hate this glare right now. There we go. So, I don't know. Um, I think that I don't regret everything that's happened. I just wish that it didn't go down the way that it did. I think that otherwise I would be a lot better. I would be a lot uh, more okay with myself, but I'm not. And, uh, I, you know, I always tell myself, like, I'm not blaming you for everything because it was both on us. So, yeah, I mean, now we're okay, but it's almost like we don't know each other at all. Like, we're just complete different, like, we're just two completely different strangers. And it's kind of weird because, like, for the type of history that we had, I would just expect someone to care a little bit more and to be concerned with my well-being just a little bit. Um, I'm not mad at you, I just, I wish I wasn't struggling trying to trust people. I wish that it was easy for me to just be okay with everyone and not be scared. I don't like just talking to anyone. I don't, you know, I have an issue just talking with people or talking to anyone because of what's happened. And I do hope that even throughout all this that your life still turns out amazing because I still think after everything that you are still an amazing person but you know our lives just lead different directions and it just wasn't meant to be so yeah hope everything goes well for you